Hey designers, take your editing to the next level with these three presets in Adobe Premiere Pro. These presets will make your workflow smoother and elevate your projects. To get started, you'll need to download them. The download link is provided in the description. First, enter your email address on the download page and click download. Check your email inbox for the file. If you don't see it, check the all mail or spam folder, as sometimes the email lands there. Once you find it, click on the download link in the email. Next, open Adobe Premiere Pro. To import the presets, go to the Effects panel. Right-click on the Presets section and choose Import Preset. Locate the file you downloaded. Once imported, click on the drop-down arrow next to Presets in the Effects panel, and you'll find your new presets listed there. Now, let's create something using the first preset. Select the text tool and click anywhere on the screen to create a text layer. Drag and drop the Arial based text preset onto this text layer. Next, change the text to whatever you like. Highlight the text, go to the text options, and customize it. You can adjust the fill color, stroke color, or make any other changes you want. Let's also change the font to give it a new look and reduce its size slightly. Here's how it looks now. Apply the Stabilize pop-in effect to the text layer. Once you play it, the text will pop up on the screen like this. You can add more text layers, change their content, and apply this effect. No matter how many text layers you add, they'll pop up with the same smooth animation. Now, let's move on to the second process. Start by creating a rectangle. You can place a picture or anything else within it. Once the rectangle is ready, set its color to black and reduce the opacity. Then, select this layer and apply the slide and up effect. Follow it up with the slide out down effect. When you play it, you'll see the rectangle slide in and, after a few seconds, slide out perfectly. Place one picture on top of another and split the top picture like this. Apply the zoom in center effect to the first layer and the zoom out center effect to the second layer. When you preview the animation, you'll see the smooth transition of zooming in and out between the two layers. Now, place two pictures on top of each other. Apply the slide transition effect between them, and you'll see a smooth transition like this. Next, let's work with two more pictures stacked on top of each other. Split the top layer. On the first part of the split layer, apply the cinematic border in effect. Then, on the second part, apply the cinematic border out effect. When you play it, the transition will have a cinematic look, like this. If you want to fine tune the effect, go to the effects panel and adjust the settings as per your preference. For a smoother result, apply motion blur to enhance the overall effect and make it look more professional. I hope you found this tutorial helpful. If you did, please like, comment, and don't forget to subscribe to Ace Designs for more content like this.